Is that a is that a username? Oh my god. Is it actually people all the way out here? No fucking way. Dude! There's people out here? What? No. Yeah, there is people. I'm staring at one. What are you doing here? <laughs> and what are all these people uh, doing here? We're clearly natives. Oh, yeah. Yeah, natives. Mm -hmm. That's what they all say. Okay, why are we attacking me? This is not a very welcoming way of doing things. Um, We're natives and you're in America. Yeah, I'm not, Okay, yeah, I am American, uh, but like... I am too. Relax! Okay? I mean, I, I, I come in peace. I, I really come in peace, you know what I'm saying? Oh, hey. That's me. And this, this is Corecraft. The sequel. I should probably explain what this is, so let's move on. A person named Dreve put this all together, and I happen to be one of the few that actually made an application to join, and I got accepted. I made a few friends right off the bat when I joined, and I didn't film after all this had started, so this is actually Dreve's perspective right now. Right after we started, I instantly started punching Dreve because I didn't want him to get the wood. But after that, I just started wandering into nowhere. And then JB made another portal right next to us, and then I just made a base right next to it. Uh, I never really used the nether portal in the entire game. It's right next to Soul Sand Valley and the Crimson Forest. But other than that, yeah, I don't use it. Then suddenly, Dreep comes out of nowhere with a sword above Loveheart, but I think they're teaming, so I end up just getting this funny clip that I wanted to turn into a meme. So here it is. Anyways, I make a small path down to the portal with the grass, and then I decide yeah, now that the travel is going to take way too long, so I decided to sail across six, no, more than that, like 9,000 blocks to get to my land that I claimed on the map, and I may have died a few times off camera, but since it was off camera, it never happened. I finally get to my plot, and I begin the base of my house. You may ask, why is it floating? Well, that's because I'm going to make the floor a little bit higher. Then, BAM! Ha! <laughs> wait, oh wait, it's not done. BAM! There we go, okay. Wait, mob heads are also a thing? Oh, it's a data pack for the server. Alright. Yeah, we'll be getting into that later as well. Uh, later on, I promise Exponite to give him five snowballs, and I ride it on my wall. Later on, I find a village, and I get a horse, because there's a village next to my base. Fun fact. It's, like, 500 blocks away, but we're not gonna- don't worry about that, alright? The village had three diamonds and two saddles, so I got a horse. I named him Glue. I'm not sure if I even show it though. Anyways, Dreef tells me that's a reference because he names his horse Glue apparently. And he tries to show us, but he absolutely fails because every single clip that he shows us does not have a horse named Glue in it. He like named his horse Erwin or something like that. Eh, whatever. We just made a lot of jokes about the horse and then the creeper blows up a corner of my house later on. I'm not sure if I even catch it on camera, but we'll see. Anyways, thanks to Drift, I decided I shouldn't use diorite to make a snow path down from my base to the valley. And while mining for diorite, I, just by happenstance and not because I live on a mountain and that's where deep darks spawn, encountered a deep dark, and I may have summoned a warden while at it.
And then uh, me and Dre talked, and we realized uh, we could get warden heads. But that's for, don't worry, that's for another video. And then I come up with my second goal, uh, because, yes, um, mm hmm And also, my other goal, which is unannounced, is to make a nether highway. But that means I gotta get ice, and that means I require silk touch. Which means I need a villager trading hall. So, I made a villager trading hall. I made a really simple one because it's my first time. I got five villagers and three are Larvarians, and they give me like really good boats. But I need a lot of emeralds, and those other two villagers are Fletchers. And if you don't know, Fletchers give emeralds in return for a lot of sticks. Which means I gotta do some deforestation. Don't you just love deforestation? I do. Anyways, I get a simple farm going, and I decide I need a nether portal. Ah, there we go. Oh, time, time to go in, I guess. <laughs> 